89.9 FM, the East Bay's best variety. I got my dude, Adrian. Man. What's up with oh, it? Or should What's I say, it? Pastor Adrian? Man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. In the building. What's popping with it, boss? Oh, man. It, hey, man, I'm, I'm feeling real good, man, today. Yeah. Happy to be here. Yes, you yes. Know, uh, chilling out with... With K KCRH, yes, yes. 89.9 FM, man, uh, it's real big. Real big. Yes, sir. So I got my dude Adrian Man up in the building, man, and he got a couple of new songs. Uh, he was talking about you had this video of, of, the, of the shootout with the stuff. So, yes, uh, Sandy Hook. Sa yeah, can we, can we uh, go into the details of, of, of that? Yes, sir, man. You know, uh, that was a tragic, a, a very tragic, very uh, tragic event there. You know, yes. I woke up uh, Friday, Friday morning. Got on the iPad, looked, you know, looked, seen the information on Facebook, and it kind of, I mean, it blew my mind. Yes, you know, I mean, these little sad, children, man. six, seven years old, you know, lost their life because somebody went into school and went crazy. That was just, yeah. You know, and I'm it touched me. You know, it really touched my heart because I have a daughter. You know, yeah. my daughter is five, and I wouldn't even, never imagine something like that. I would go crazy, you know, man. Oh, man. I, I would probably need a whole lot of psychiatric help, man, you know. Oh, but man. but the thing was is that you know uh, the situation that happened to them. I knew that the media is real hyped on it. They was real hyped on it. I'm talking about it. Mm -hmm. But I knew two three weeks later or a month later, mm -hmm. people are going to die down about talking about it. Right, right. You know. But the frustration of the lives of the the, the parents and the grandparents, the and families, the families. You know, they, they that's going to be a probably a long life. A pro healing process. Right. A yes. Long life healing process. And life healing for the whole life. Come on, that's it. That, because that's a terrible thing. I mean, if I lost my kid at five or something like that, I would just, I would go insane. Right. Uh, exactly. <laughs> when I saw right. that on the internet, on, the, on, on TV, I, I just couldn't believe it. Yes. Now, now my, my question to you is, what, what did you think about that? I, I think that... Um, you, 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 are you saying that just the, just the, the whole, whole situation in it, general? I, I think it was um, a shocker, you yeah. know, to all of the parents, and because it was close to Christmas and the holidays, yeah. nobody was uh, looking forward to something like that happening. And I think it was terrible. It was you know, very so terrible, I went yeah. to the studio Horrible. and touched my heart, even though I didn't know the family, didn't know the children. It touched my heart because I kids are very you precious. can re relate. Yeah, I can relate to a situation like that. We have a lot of killing going on in the Bay Area with children. Mm -hmm. So I went to the studio and did a song for them because I wanted the song to touch. I want this song to touch their lives, mm -hmm. you know, and, and hopefully that they it can bring some healing to their lives. And you make know, a change. And make a change mm -hmm. and help their grief and suffering. And, you know, we're praying for them. We're praying for Newtown, Connecticut, and also the Bay yes. Area. And when I did the song, a lot of people from the Bay Area hit me up on my Facebook, my Twitter. Yeah. Like, man, you know, you from the Bay. You ain't, you, have, <laughs> you ain't did nothing about the Bay Area children that passed away. Yeah. Listen, that's my next day. I'm getting ready to do mm -hmm. something for the Bay Area, for the children and, and all the young people that's losing their lives out here. Yes. Uh, I might not have did a song yet, but I am very active in the community. I mean, that song already shows that you're people. active. Yes. And, and the reason why I, I say you would have put that on your top priority is because that was one of the deadliest in America yeah, that massacres was terrible. For, for at that age. Right. Uh, the kids. So, you know, I mean, yeah, the Bay Area going to get it too, but at the end of the day, though, that was just a shocker to have it, period, in America. It was terrible. Yeah. Like, wow. So so now now that you got the song out, right, it's, what is the name of the song? It's called uh, Let God Hold Your Hand. Let God Hold Your Hand. Yes. When did you create it? Who produced it? Who's on it? Uh, you know what? Genius Beats. Genius, Genius Beats from Seattle produced it. Yeah. It's banging. It's banging. Uh, it's a great song. And we re actually, we created it on December 16th. Yeah, like a sampling or something, huh? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Let me hold your hand. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was dope right there. Yeah, I like yeah, that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know, the old school... <laughs> You know, we did the old school track and redid it and put it up, put nice. it back out there. Right on, right on. Yes. So where can we check it out at? You can check that track out on YouTube. Go to YouTube, check it out. Uh, just log in, Ager Man Tribute. Mm -hmm. Ager Man, of, uh, uh, what is it under? Ager Man Tribute. <laughs> just Google it. Right, Google it. But Ager Man official, official Tribute to Sandy, Sandy Hook. Sandy Hook. If y'all just go to YouTube and push Adrian Man Tribute, it's going to pop up. Yes. You're going to see it. And the way it's spelled is A-G-E-R-M-A-N. -E it's one, one word? M-A-N. A-G-E-R-M-A-N, one word. Google that, log on, blog on. Check out my dude, Adrian Man, formerly yes, of Three Times Crazy. And, um, you know, you, now you're doing the church thing as well. Yes, sir. Uh, I got uh, the gospel rap church going. Gospel rap. I, I mean, some people is just like, what is that? 
you know, gospel rap is, is, is the gospel of Jesus Christ uh -huh. in rap form. Right, right. A lot of people don't know what a gospel rap church is. It's, it's a church. Some people haven't heard of it. Right. No, no, a lot of people haven't heard of it. Yes. It's, a, it's a church. It's a regular church. Yeah. But it has the, the, the gospel rap in the service. Wow. Yeah, gospel so we got two or three rappers, service. you know, that come by and rap. What? We even have rappers that belong to our church. What? And I'm a rapper myself, but of I course. preach and I rap sometimes, but we have rappers that come and... He reach, preach and rap, preach. Reach, reach <laughs> preach and rap. I like that. <laughs> I like, so how did you come up with this concept of actually doing this? Because some people's like, you can't do gospel rap or, or, uh, uh, or, or you know, put rap in church or something. Like, right, right. What made you do that? Well, you know, uh, the, the rap music is very um, uh, relative. Re relative uh, re <laughs> I'll be getting that word mixed up, but it's relative. It, it, you know, it relates. Relates. Right. To That's, the young people. Right. So, you know, it, it's a draw card. Mm -hmm. It draws people into Christ. Yes. It draws people into, into God. And God is not all about you know, being stiff and, mm -hmm. you know, God is a God of, you know, he give us talents and abilities to mm -hmm. reach people yes. in ways that maybe a preacher or maybe a choir couldn't reach, mm -hmm. you know, uh, this generation. But see, because this generation is, is this hip hop generation. Yeah, yeah. And so he'll use the gospel, the, the gospel rap to reach those that don't know about God. Right. You know, so it's, it, yeah, it's, it's, it's very uh, influential to the young people. Yeah, I was pretty generation. shocked when I saw it. A couple of the people that I talked to, there was like gospel rap. They're like, where is it at? Right. So, so where can we check it out at? Oh, y'all, go <laughs> yeah, well, check out agermanworld.com. That's A-G-E-R-M-A-N-W-O-R-L-D.com. Yes. Go to the store page. You can mm -hmm. check out all my music there, gospel rap music. And also go to the media page where you can see all the videos. Media page. And it's all on the website, agermanworld.com. Yes, sir. Yes. Okay, so um, check it out there. Log on, blog on. So um, when do you have these uh, services to, to like, so if anybody wanted to check it out? Yes, yeah. yes. Where, where, where? You know what? Uh, um, February 2nd is the next service. Okay. It's every first Saturday of every month. We only do it once a month. That's nice. Uh, but February, February 2nd is the next service. Mm -hmm. And so every first Saturday of every month, please come out. It's on a Saturday at 2 p.m., February 2nd, and the address is 2043 East 21st Street off of 21st Avenue in Oakland, California, zip code 94606 at Israelite Missionary Baptist Church. Come through. Y'all going to be blessed. Blessed. Have a great time.